facility construction. In pipeline construction, we covered constructing the pipeline. This video lesson covers building the facilities, pump stations, tank farms, metering stations, and those sorts of things. Again, a lot of videos in here, which were a lot of fun to go and shoot. Here's a clip from facility construction. And one of the very important quality control steps that the contractor does is to qualify the pipeline welders and the pipeline welding procedures. So we have a welding procedure, we qualify the procedure, we have welder qualification, and the API standard we typically use is standard 1104. So what is the procedure? The procedure explains how the welding is going to be done, the type of welding stick that's going to be done. Is it going to be automatic welding? Is it going to be manual welding? What are the temperatures going to be? What are the amperages going to be? How many passes are there going to be? All of those types of things. We, we write the procedure, then we qualify the procedure. Usually, one of the best welders qualifies the procedure. It means they make a weld using that procedure. So we do this test by having the welder take two pieces of pipe, line them up and weld them together. And you can see about halfway down, there's a circumferential weld. And then the little oval is showing that right there, we have cut out a strap, a piece that goes across where the weld seam is. And then we take those, and we have two of them here, two different tests. The one on the left, we have basically taken the strap, ground it down, cut little notches where the weld is and pulled it to make sure it breaks at a force that would be stronger than the parent material of the pipe. And then we've taken another strap of pipe, as you can see on the right, and we've ground it down and we put it in the bending machine and we bent it. What we're looking for there is does this weld crack when you subject it to force? Because as we're welding, we can accomplish a weld that's more brittle than the pipe around it. And we do all kinds of procedures around pre-treating and post-treating and all those sorts of things to make sure the metallurgy of the weld is good and it's not brittle. So a way of testing the welders. Now if you look at this slide, you can see that this was just a straight piece of pipe. In the next slide, I'll show you what we do if we have welders that are welding on, on more complex configurations of pipe. So here it is. You can see that these are more complex pieces of pipe. It's more difficult to make that weld where we're welding the outlet into that pipe, the straight pipe, than it was just to put two pipes together. So the station welder testing and qualification. You can see there, we do the same things. We cut straps out of there. They use a cutting torch, cut them out to be able to then take them and perform the same types of tests as I showed you in the other slide just before this one. I hope you enjoyed that clip. If you want to know more about this or any other lesson, please contact me at tom at pipelineknowledge.com or call me at the phone number. And if you like this little clip, please click on the subscribe button and you'll get notified when more tutorials and more clips are posted on YouTube.